Are you sure about that? <laughs> There he is. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexon and welcome back everybody to The Crafting Dead. Yes, I said it, it is finally back, so if you guys can all hit that like button, let's go see if we can reach 100 likes for the big return of The Crafting Dead. Now, the reason why I'm pretty much bringing it back now is because in October, The Walking Dead returns, and I figured it'd be the perfect time to bring back The Crafting Dead and have some fun on the servers. We are actually on Seaport server number one, and today we dressed up, I don't know what we dressed up, but I wanted to dress up as kind of like like a spooky Halloween type costume and just go around the cities patrol and just pretty much kind of scare people or just kind of be the bad guy in some sense and see how that works out for us so we're gonna do slash our spawn we're gonna get right into this guys it's been a while since I played on here but it is good to be back it is really awesome to be back to be honest so um, as you can see I do have an FNFAL and just an extra clip and I just bought the rest of the gear so this is the it's it's been a while guys it really has and I know a lot of you guys have been missing the crafting dead and uh, so have I to be honest and I do want to mention one thing in the comment sections please if you're watching this video and are a big fan of the crafting dead just leave me your suggestions of what I should do in general with the crafting dead I mean I just need some ideas that's all I really need oh butcher meat clever this is perfect for our freaking Halloween scary looking costume. Look at this. I'd be scared if I ran into this dude. And yeah, these these zombies are no threat for us. But yeah, guys, I'd really appreciate in the comment sections if you could all just leave a comment of what I should do in general with the Crafting Dead. Now, as you all know, Fear the Crafting Dead is the roleplay I do on this channel. Um, and that will also be having its return. However, I am doing a big kind of revamp on it. I'm really working hard to cast some members. So if you guys want to be involved in Fear the Crafting Dead, this is big news, guys, for you guys as well. If you want to be in fear, uh, involved in Fear the Crafting Dead as an actor for an episode or just for a few little things like this, and you are just interested in it, then let me know in the comment sections. I'd pretty much be looking forward to see what I can do with that. I want to make sure we do have a good amount of pe- Oh, is that a per- Oh my gosh, there's a person right here, guys. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Alright, buddy, where are you? I think I just saw him. I forgot in uh, the crafting day we don't have the mic, so we can't really- Uh, did he escape? Oh, what? There he is. There he is. We got him. Alrighty, guys. We are doing a pretty good job with freaking people out because that guy was scared, as you guys can tell. But uh, what I wanted to say... Alright, we got to get out of here before we attract any more people. And we do not want to attract any more people. Let's grab some more food. But, uh, yeah, if you guys are interested in being in, in part of the Fear the Craft and Dead roleplay, then let me know in the comment section. I'm curious to having some small body actors maybe here and there and just some survivors to uh, just to cast in for, like, an episode or for a few small moments in an episode. I'll be looking forward to that. Also, I'd really like if you guys can just give me a... Um, a hand on some youtubers that you guys would like to get involved in this roleplay as well So that'd be pretty cool as well So if you guys have any youtubers they want to see involved then please do so let me know in the comment sections And I'll try my best to contact them and yeah, it should be pretty cool. All right, let's see what else we need some uh, a can opener Oh geez, these walkers are doing a pretty good job here. All right uh, All right, let me let me take you out here. There we go and let me just get this rag, clean it up right here in the water. So now we have ourselves a rag, just in case we do get some damage here. Alright, we do have a frying pan. Why is it so difficult to find some food around here? What is going- Oh, okay, there's more of you around here. No, you're gonna- you're gonna leave me alone. There we go, let's take you out of the way. There we go. Also, the sounds seem excessively loud, so I'm gonna turn those down a bit. There we go. All right, let's keep looking around. I don't. I'm not seeing. Oh, there's a zombie stuck in here. All right, I don't see any food. All right, nah, I mean that's that. That's not bad. All right, there's this dude right here. All right, back off, dude. And also for the people saying hi in the chat. Oh, I got infected from that. Are you kidding me? All right, that that I call I call hacks on that for sure. Um, but I was I was saying for all the people who are you know kind in the comment sections and always saying hi, I appreciate it. Um, you know, thank you for all the support. I I would like to say hi back, <laughs> but it's really difficult when I'm in a situation like this one. Uh, but actually, can I use slash heal on this? Slash heal? Did it work? No, it did not. All right. So, uh, that is not good. So we're gonna have to find, I don't know if I have in my E-chest anything by any chance, but 
Uh, if we can find an RBI cure, that would be pretty nice. But it's not a big deal. We can we can survive this. We can definitely survive this. I've been through much worse. All right, we got to jump that right there. Uh, I don't see any people, actually. I see a lot of zombies. That is for sure. So let's keep looking around, see if we kind of uh, escape most of these zombies. And let me see if I have anything in my e-chest slash e-chest. Uh, oh, I do have RBI. I just need a syringe. Okay, my hopes are back up because I'm pretty sure you can find a syringe pretty easy sometimes around here. You just got to look for the right places. Did I get shot? No, I didn't. Okay, let's uh, drink up some iced tea from all this running here. All right, let's see. Is there anything else we can find? No. Okay. Oh, bacon. Okay, I'm going to take this tactical bacon here. Blood bag. Uh, I feel like we got to go to a medical facility. The odds of finding a syringe in this place is just a little to nothing right now. So, oh no. Oh no, here comes the sneeze. Oh boy. <coughs> <coughs> Woo! Yeah, there we go. Good thing I warned you guys or you guys would have got like freaking freaked out from that. Alright, that was loud. I am still sick, so I apologize for you guys who are listening to my stuffy voice. Uh, but I am just, uh, you know, finally getting out of the cold. So, that's the best part about it. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Um, but I still want to make videos for you guys as always. I'm always trying to you know up my quality and things like that Oh a med pack. I'm going to use this med pack and Maybe it'll help us out probably won't but no it definitely won't right now But just in case we uh, run into any more trouble we can definitely use that it's not too bad being infected right now uh, We're not in the worst shape possible, but uh, that's okay But yeah guys um, going back to what I asked earlier was if you guys can just leave some comments down below in the comment section just simply suggesting what I should do with the crafting dead, you know, the crafting dead server, the survival, just the roleplay, or just a new idea of what I could do with the crafting dead in general. I just would really like to get your feedback on that. It'd be really awesome. Is this a pumpkin mask? All right, I think it's it's well needed that a pumpkin mask looks pretty cool. We got We got to work with that team or that theme. Why did I say team? <laughs> um, is this FNFAL? Oh, that is FNF. No, it's not. I got my my uh, my hopes up too high. Alright, uh, we're actually kind of running low on food. Is there anything simple around here I can grab or snatch? Probably not. Alright, so this place is a letdown besides for the mask. What is that over there? Alright, that's a zombie. I have to get used to the uh, gun shooting again because I'm so used to decimation here and there. Uh, they just swapped out the controls, so... Uh, it does make it a bit difficult here and there, but it's not a big deal. Okay, now we definitely got to use this med pack. Running low on food. I believe I do have slash feed. We're going to do that right now because we are in a dire situation, and it's kind of much needed. Guys, If it's is it me or is it this map is getting a bit more detailed into? Because I haven't seen the buildings as detailed uh, when it first came out, and it looks like now they're just really stepping up their game. So... Uh, that's pretty cool to see that. Alright, let's get, um, some blood here. Blood bag, there we go. Let's throw that back out. Alright, so that's pretty cool. I wonder if, if we go back up here. There, it is more, uh, decorated. I'm pretty impressed, guys, right now. And I think there's loot up here, too. Yeah, so they really, uh, have been working on this server. Oh, can opener. Okay, we can actually open up some stuff here. This is what I needed, kind of, more than anything. Alright, cool. So far, we only spooked one person out, but it's not a big deal. Uh, hopefully we can get some more people, but, you know, if not, it's fine. I'm gonna probably just open all of these. I'm not gonna worry too much about the rest. Now, this M1 Grand have any clips in it? No, it didn't. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Uh, what is going on? Oh, no, not going there. Alright. So, it kind of stinks. I don't know if I can use it. No, you can't really have a bottled... <gasps> Empty syringe! Yes! Alright, there we go. Just as I was talking about it, we got what we needed, and now we are no longer infected. We are, we are good right now. We are no longer infected. I'm pretty happy about that one. Oh, do I see people? Nope, that's just a lot of zombies. All right, there's no more upstairs, so we're just going to have to keep walking down here. Um, we're going to need probably some type of uh, water or something eventually because hydration levels, they're kind of going down right now, so I want to make sure I don't, don't die from uh, dehydration. That would be pretty sad. All right, let's kill these zombies off here. You guys don't belong here. There you go. There we go. Okay, uh, anything else around here? Let's see. Probably not. All right, so we made it back to the floor. Is there anyone around here? I'm actually kind of curious. We only ran into one person, and that guy almost killed me. I mean, he had, I think he got a few rounds on that M1 Grand. I was worried it was something else, but, uh, I think we're okay right now. I think we're fine. All right, let's keep looking around. Oh, there's a guy right there. 
Yep, we got him. There we go. Oh, no, we didn't. There it is. We got him. All right, that's what I'm talking about. I'm a bit rusty, but we finally got everything back where it's supposed to be. What does this guy have? All right, so we had some basic stuff. Did he have anything inside the backpack? That's my, my main question. What do you have in here? Ooh, an RBI syringe. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. We're going to store this in our e-chest quickly because um, that is some good stuff. And we're going to throw this backpack out, put back ours, and let's get out of here. Also, we don't want to leave any evidence behind because we are dressed up here to spook people out. And uh, I think it's working out. It is pretty freaky. All right, let's uh, reload our um, gun here. Let's reload it. No, no, not that, not that. Okay, there we go. Reload. All right, looking good. I don't want to be too much in the open, but so far we got ourselves two player kills, 11, 11 zombie kills. So I'm pretty happy about that. All right, let's keep looking. Anything else? We were here just earlier in the parking lot. Uh, I'm attracting a lot of walkers. So I'm going to start heading out and possibly to the left of this direction here i know we came from this area but i just want to see what's going on if anything and of course these episodes are going to be around 15 minutes so uh i just wanted to let you guys know ahead of time so you're not freaking out as to why it ended kind of early but yeah 15 minute crafting the episodes for now and then eventually if we want to change that we can look into that uh but if anything the most you know important thing if you guys can help me out is to down below in the comment sections is just to give me some feedback i need to know how can i spice up the crafting dead because you guys love the crafting dead but i figured you guys have been seeing a lot of the same old and i think it's maybe just time to change things up for a bit and you know work on something fresh and i think you guys hopefully will like that idea and support me and just think of something unique that'd be kind of cool there is a uh, supply drop, but I'm not going to go to those because from past experience, if you're running solo, you're probably going to get destroyed because a lot of people go to the supply drops. However, if we're close to it, I'm probably going to give it a shot. So it's at negative 952, negative 952. Uh, we're not even close. Oh, wait. Uh, no, we're not really that close. However, if we go in this direction... We're kind of you know what we're gonna go for it. We're gonna negative nine five two So we're gonna go in this in this uh, direction and see if we can find it now I'm a bit worried because we are gonna be in the open, but uh, we're just gonna have to go for it now This is a far out stretch It's definitely across somewhere else it's probably at an airport or something because it's, um I don't really want to go through the water. So we are not gonna go in this direction. All right zombie, dude uh, we're gonna have to can we cross through there? No, we can't we're gonna have to go around here All right, I'm gonna take down the cords. We're probably not gonna have time for that supply drop But um, if we did if I was closer, I'd definitely go probably go for that run because the supply drops are pretty much really OP so uh, That's something to oh, is this the docks right here? Oh, this is the docks. All right, it's kind of cool. All right, but if I walk in this direction I mean it does no, it's not gonna work really too. Well, it's a far. It's a far walk uh, not worth it definitely not worth it right now for me uh, at the moment, but we can just look around gather up some more supplies as you can see here There's some good amount of supplies on the dock So I'm pretty happy if you guys want to get on this server um, the IP will not be in the description however, if you go to the Technic launcher and Download the craft in that official uh, mod pack you can actually then go on to multiplayer and pretty much um, You know find this server without using an IP. So that's the that's the cool part right there. All right, let's eat up some rotten berries here just for some hydration. All right, is that not working? Uh, a bit of lag, I guess. Well, if it is going to lag out, that means it's time to end off the episode because we are at the 15-minute mark. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys hit that like button. Oh, wait, we got this here. Empty water canteen. Just perfect. All right, there it is, guys. So if you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys hit that like button. Also, if you want to see more Crafting Dead, let me know in the comment sections. Again, let me know if you have new ideas for the Crafting Dead so I can contribute them and spice things up. Other than that, my name is Alex, and peace out, guys, and stay fox.